Nickwood. What's up guys, Terrible Vapor, and today we're going to be going over Nick Witch John S. movie. 6 milligrams, 50-50, unless otherwise stated. Does it say otherwise? I don't believe so. Yeah, 6 milligrams, 50-50. So, Nickwood. I've talked about Nickwood before. What's so great about Nickwood? Well, for one, Nickwood is mixed in one of the cleanest clean rooms in the country. They pride themselves in their clean room. If you go onto their website, which will be in the link below, they have a section dedicated towards it. And I'm not going to read it off because, one, I don't feel like pulling up the website, and two, I'd probably bore you with jargon that even I had a little bit of a struggle understanding. But their clean room is immaculate. What does that necessarily mean? What that means is the flavors and the taste come out exceptionally pure. The flavors in Nickwood are done, usually crafted so well that it's just smooth. It's it's smooth and it's perfect and it's tasteful. Nickwood just comes out to be one fantastic juice. Most ki most times, most juice I've tried from them, I've become a big fan of. Just because it comes out to be so clean and so pure. And today we're going to be focusing on straw banana smoothie. A strawberry banana smoothie in case you couldn't tell. I'm weird with smoothie flavors just because I found a majority of them tend to come out really funky. And I've watched a lot of them come out with a milk overtone. Um, because they do it for like a shake or a smoothie. A lot of people when they make a smoothie flavor, they don't exactly know what they want. So they try and go for a milkshake or a smoothie flavor. Um, they confuse the two, and I get a lot of milk overtones in them, and I'm not a big milk fan. As a matter of fact, I'm allergic to milk. Um, so naturally, uh, I don't like the taste of milk, because it makes me sick. I, I blink it with being sick. So I'm not going to like the taste of milk whatsoever. Um, there's no milk in a smoothie, but people get that confused pretty often, I've noticed. Um, so trying a smoothie, we're going to go over it, test it out, see how it tastes, how she vapes. Let's get into this review, shall we? So about the setup, Plumeville on top of a Sir Lancelot dual parallel 24 gauge uh, comes out to approximately 0.1. It's my preferred build, and that's my go-to build for just about everything. Oh man. Oh man. The hit on that is... A 3 out of 5. It's good to know that the hit is delayed. Uh, you don't feel it right away. It creeps up on you. Then when it gets to you, it hits you like a wall of bricks. Um, I feel comfortable giving the hit a 3.5 out of 5. It, it's pretty powerful at 6 milligrams. And um, it, it's a creeping hit. It's not necessarily right away. I feel it as a mix in my head and my chest. Now the chest is obviously very, very up front. It's very quick. It just kind of it snaps, just like every chest it does. The head hit is a little bit delayed, though. I don't know if that's just a juice quality or if I'm just experiencing that, but that's what I get. As far as the taste and taste strength on this flavor, the taste and taste strength, the taste is a very clean, very crisp, very pure strawberry banana smoothie. There is no milk, as there shouldn't be. There is no impurities. It's one of the purest, cleanest flavors I've ever had. Now, you may be saying to yourself, what is an impure flavor? I've never had an impure flavor. I've never had a flavor that tastes like that. And you can't really appreciate how clean Nickwood is until you try it and realize just how defined it is. And that purity comes out in how it's defined, in how it comes, uh, how do I word this? It comes out with the flavors being so bold and so, not necessarily in your face, but just being what they are in terms of straightforward. Uh, there is no guessing as to what it is. It's strawberry banana smoothie, flat out. The taste is spot on, and it's just such a clean juice. It's hard to put in the words. you got to try a bottle for yourself. And that relates back to the Nickwood Clean Room. With the Nickwood Clean Room, that's a tongue twister, Nickwood Clean Room. I don't know why it's a tongue twister, but it is. Anyway, back to the Nickwood Clean Room. When you get something like that, it's just so clean and so pure, it, it has to be attributed to the Clean Room because there's virtually no imperfections at all. And very rarely do they get in, if ever. Uh, and it's, it's, again, really hard to put into words, but it makes a massive difference. If you compare this with, with another juice, you'll see. Uh, 
In my opinion, this beats out almost every shop tooth I've had. And not necessarily in terms of taste strength. The taste strength I'm going to rate, we'll get an 8 out of 10. It just beats it in terms of just how fresh it is. It, it, it feels fresh. A good example is like picking a ripe banana off the vine and getting a banana out of the grocery store. They're going to be different. Or any fruit, for example. Take a fruit off the vine, a ripe fruit off the vine, and a fruit out of a grocery store. It's just going to taste different. The fruit off the vine is going to be just that much fresher and that much better. That's how I describe Nickwood. It's just like it's ripe. Like it's fresh, freshly made. And But it doesn't really comply with e-juice because a fresh made e-juice and a steeped e-juice do have their own differences. It's kind of comparing apples and oranges, but that's the best analogy that I have. If you haven't tried Nickwood, you need to. The website's in the description below. I would recommend starting with Straw Nana Smoothie because uh, I've gone through four or five bottles of it and every single one's been the exact same. It's smooth, it's straightforward. If you have a couple other flavors I'd recommend such as, I think it's Daybreak if you're into tobacco flavors. Now, I'm not a tobacco person but I can vape on Daybreak all day. Um, just give it a shot. There's only one flavor I haven't liked from them. I'm saving that for another review. My overall rating on Nick Wood's Straw Nana Smoothie, I almost forgot that one. My overall rating on this is a 10 out of 10, and it's just how fresh it is, the taste strength. You really can't go wrong with Nicholas Shot in a smoothie. This has been Terrible Vapor. Thanks for watching. Keep vaping, happy vaping, and stay cloudy.